Okay, so Margaret and I <clears throat> event today. We didn't get to our main place. Not, Not our fault. Not our fault. Not our fault. Uh, what happened? Our plane was late. Our plane landed late in Detroit, so we missed our connection. We so we're stuck here in Detroit. I've always wanted to go to Detroit. <laughs> yeah. It's been on my bucket list. I'm sure if there's anybody out there that's from the Detroit, I'm sure it's very nice, but... Yes, but... It wasn't part of our plan, and yeah. we have nothing with us. Our nope. bags, nope. just our purses. Got a text from the airline saying that my baggage made it to Iron Mountain. <laughs> <laughs> We're pretty excited about that. <laughs> made it all the way to Iron Mountain, Getting which our... is good. <laughs> yeah. kept... So anyway, no toothbrush. Oh, we were going to ask. If they would give oh, us we a can toothbrush. Still right on there. We got vouchers for a free meal. It was <laughs> horrible. It was just horrible. No, no, I'm so d- glad I didn't pay for it. <laughs> that wasn't very good. No. So we are here for <clears throat> till tomorrow at six in the evening. So I'll keep adding update you on our crazy. It's gonna get but Lucille and Ethel, we're out and about. We're <laughs> we'll we'll get there and we'll have fun. <laughs> Damn it. <laughs> Well, we finally made it. Oh my gosh, you guys. Getting out of Detroit was not easy. But we are here now in Iron Mountain, Michigan. And this is the lake we're staying on. I'm sorry, I don't remember the name of it. For the first couple of nights. Pretty. Very nice. I didn't... This is my first look at it because we got in and it got dark right away. Went out for a nice dinner with Margaret's brother and his wife. And yeah, we're settled in. She's off visiting her mom. And I'm just going to come out and go for a walk. So we'll go for a walk. <laughs> yeah, the hotel we stayed in. Oh my gosh. Well, I'll do a clip of Margaret and I in the hotel. The rooms were okay. Margaret found a big black furry spider. Not huge, huge. Not a black widow or anything, I don't think. But oh my gosh. Yeah, so that was exciting. Food was not good, but you know what? We had a place to stay and we're thankful for it. So, getting then we just spent the day waiting for there was only one flight out. So, we waited till the next day at six to fly out. And then we get on the plane, and there was a lady, God bless her, but she was in a neck brace wheelchair it's kind of slumped over when she was waiting for the plane and i was like oh my gosh she doesn't look in like she's in good condition nope she got on there and started crying about she wanted to go to the hospital but she didn't want to get off the plane and she was pretty much out of it and so they did their best the staff to kindly get her off the plane right oh my gosh so that took a half an hour and of course, I'm sitting next to an older lady who I'm helping open her packages, buckle her. <laughs> Just seems to be my way in life. That's, And she kept thanking me. She was a sweet lady, but she was getting agitated because we weren't taking off and it was so hot and she was worried or something. Oh my gosh, I was just trying to calm her down. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But we're here and life is good. <laughs> One of the things we're doing is getting her hair cut because she said the place last time she went was 10 bucks i'm sure it's more than that but i pay 50 bucks and that's low where i live so and margaret's happy with the gal so let's do her i'm ready we are going to a wedding leaving what is that tomorrow i guess friday for another part i can't remember the name of the town margaret's in charge of this trip anyway so i want to look better she had me bring all this cold weather clothes, as I've talked about, and it's 79 today, so, but next week's supposed to cool off, so, anyway, yeah, we're gonna have fun, I'm just, after her long two days, this is perfect, just the perfect weather, the house we're staying in is owned by her brother, it's an Airbnb, he just started, very nice, perfect little two-bedroom little bungalow, yeah, so, yeah. We're just kind of, I slept quite a bit last night, just, you know, exhaustion set in. So we went out to dinner, I can't remember if I mentioned this or not, and had a great pizza. Bought some bagels, they make their fresh. It just was very nice. 
And now we're just going to have a kind of a relaxing day. She's off visiting her mom and I'm just taking a walk.